At American Family Insurance, we help protect what you've achieved so you can fearlessly go after your dreams. For auto, home, business, and life, contact us today. American Family Insurance. Insure carefully, dream fearlessly. American Family Insurance, Life Mutual Standard of Ohio and Wisconsin Company, 6000 American Parkway, Madison, Wisconsin, 53783. Agrimax and West River Ag have been in the winter area for a combined total of nine years. We offer top-of-the-line services and inputs such as chemical, seed, fertilizer application, spraying, and agronomy services with a certified crop advisor on staff. We are a full-service business that is locally owned and operated. We look forward to continuing service to the ag community and cannot wait to help you with all your ag... And here we are. We've got some cowboy action. We've got the Burke Cougars coming here to take on the Cologne Cowboys. Junior uh, varsity game to start with. Yep. And we have tip off, and here we are. Cologne gets the tip. Jonah, just Jordan, Jordan Musser <laughs> came in. And ball turn over to Burke. Yep. Shot there, missed. Rebounded by Burke. A shot missed. Rebounded by the Cowboys. Jordan Musser with the rebound. Sam Bransgard playing tonight. He uh, gave a speech in my class today about how to shoot a free throw. So maybe we'll see Sam get fouled. And really? He, he, he did? He did, yeah. I mean, it's pretty simple. He what? used a clip from one of the games of him airballing a, <laughs> a free throw of how not to do it. And then one of uh, Jonah Musser sinking one of how to do it. <laughs> well, it's one way to do it, you know. Yeah, it was very good. <laughs> and speaking of Sam, Sam will inbound the ball for us here. How not to inbound the ball. <laughs> <laughs> and a pass under the basket is stolen by Burke. And... It fought by Cash Hemming, and it bounced out of bounds off of a Burke player. It is clone ball under the basket. Sam bringing the ball in for us. Three-point shot, no good, and rebounded by Burke. And a fast break. Oh, slowing down here. Can you throw it away from me? Yep. Thank you. How to shoot a free throw? That's a that's a pretty good. That's pretty, a pretty good, good speech. I'll give him credit. Whenever someone can make a simple thing, a speech. Mm -hmm. I mean, congratulations. Well, when you really break down what you do to the point you can describe it um, cleanly. Yeah, and you know one thing after the other. And a three-point three point shot, shot by Burke. Swooshed. Then you really realize how complex a lot of these simple things we do really are. And Burke stole the ball there, and another shot does not go. Rebounded by Burke, and a foul on the shot. Two shots. So it's a 3 nothing Burke lead. And two shots for number two for the Cougars. This is how to throw, to how to shoot a free throw right here. <laughs> And no good. Rolls around the rim and out. <clears throat> I'm going to fix this, and it's not the first quarter. It's really the first half. Yep. Second shot, no good. Lane violation on Cash Hemming. So Burt gets another free throw here. Currently a 3 nothing game. And shot goes. Good. It's four to nothing. And Cologne has the ball. Come on, guys. Cash Hemming looking. 
There's a screen by William Slaymaker, but it really does nothing. And there's Loose a ball. Oh, go ahead there. Sorry. And there's a kick thing. Loose ball picked up by Tyson Wetzel, and there was a travel call, so the Cougars get the ball. And don't know what the call was. No. Nope. It ends up being clone ball. I think he might have stepped out of bounds. He was right over there. Pass to Cash running down the court. Come on, Cash. And foul out of, on Cologne or uh, Burke. I mm, think it was nope, out of bounds. My mistake. Yep. Blue ball. Well, I'm having trouble calling this tonight. Tip to throw. Or tip to pass, but Burke recovers. Burke is always a good team. Yeah. And a missed shot rebounded by Burke. Get those rebounds, guys. Come on. And fouled on the shot. He'll get two shots. I think that was Tyson. <coughs> yep, Tyson did with the foul. Number 12 gets a couple shots here. No good. Bounce off the back of the rim. That's what happens sometimes. And second shot coming up. And oh, it is perfect. Good. It's a five nothing game. Trouble with the ball control tonight with the Cowboys. William Slaymaker running in. Jonah Musser. Come on, Jonah. Passes it to Cash. Cash shoots and scores. There Puts the go. Cowboys on the board, and it is 5-2. to two. Number 22 coming down for the Cougars. Looking. Passes it into an open two, and the shot is scored. Seven to two. Timeout called by Clome. And we will take a short break too. Natural needs. Agrimax, shaping the future of ag. This is what matters. This is beyond X's and O's. This is the difference mutual respect makes. This is what character looks like. This is what defines us in South Dakota. This is sportsmanship. School sports, it's not the outcome that matters most, but the way the games are played. This message presented by the South Dakota High School Activities Association and the South Dakota Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association. Is your team or organization looking to improve their look? Are you looking for quality custom apparel with fast, friendly service from people you can trust? Then contact Apparel Works in Wagner, South Dakota. They can provide you with all kinds of options of screen printing or embroidery on your team's new uniforms or your office wear. Apparel Works is also the place to pick up your promotional items such as koozies, pens, and magnets. Contact their knowledgeable and friendly staff today. And here we are back with some more basketball. Loam will inbound the ball here. Jonah Musser with the ball. Pass to, to Jordan. His brother Jordan. Last night's cameraman. A foul. And a foul called on Burke. Well, at least it was against us. Yeah. It wasn't against us. I know what you meant. Yeah. Cash inbounds to William, passes back, and a three-point shot by Cash is perfect. What a beautiful shot. And uh, seven to five. Seven five. <coughs> you know, these are always pretty close first halves, and then one team either pulls or doesn't pull. Yeah, one team seems to pull away in the second half. Yep. And looks like you're going to fight for the ball here. And a foul. It is Burke Bull. Tyson looks like he got smacked in the face there. Fourth foul against Cologne. Gotta watch those fouls, guys. 
Number two passes yeah, three to point 22. Shot. Perfect, and it's a 10-5 game. Well, that's one way to answer back after something. Cash getting double teamed in the corner here. Tries to pass it. Surrounded by Burt players. They steal the ball, and it's missed, missed layup. Rebounded by the Cougars by Burke. Three-point shot, open. no good. Saved by Burke, but thrown Rebounded in. Rebounded by the Cowboys. Cash only coming down with the ball. Can you believe that didn't turn into points? Three-pointer by Cash, and it hits the back of the rim. Come on, Cowboys, run down there. Pass to 24. Open shot, shot missed and rebounded by Cash. Got to stop giving those open passes and pass to Tyson, but Tyson wasn't looking. Loose ball recovered by Burke. Tipped pass. Bounces off of Jonah's foot. Burke ball, and they call a timeout. And so we will take a timeout, too. 605-384-3553 or visit their website at apparelworkssd.com. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. You've spent years dreaming up your business plan, saving every dollar, searching for the right location, and perfecting your product. Auto Owners ensures your small business, because it isn't small to you. Only 36 more to go. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller and Associates. And here we are, back. 10-5 to five lead for the Burke Cougars. Passes it to number 40. Looking, passes it to 24, and a shot scored. It's tough when you leave guys open under the basket. Oh, yeah, you cannot do that. Oh, and a pass into traffic, and it is loose. And, and it is white ball. Yes, out on Burke. Good job for Tyson Wetzel. Just keep fighting for it. Yes. Don't let him have it. Make him earn it. Inbound pass to Sam. Back to Cash. Come on, Cash. Pass to Jonah Musser. Come on, Machine. Passes it to William. William. Sam looking. Tipped pass goes out of bounds on Burke. And it stays here. Ten seconds on the shot clock, though. <laughs> Sub, Shea Monroe coming in for Sam Bransgard. Shea's going to inbound the ball for us. Finds Cash Hemming with a three-pointer. Oh, oh, it looks so good. They always look good, but it's never actually good. <laughs> And shot, shot is missed. no good for Burke. Rebounded and out of bounds on Tyson Wetzel with the block shot there. I think he just smacked it out of his hands. And Jordan Musser comes in for Tyson. Burke inbounds. Don't give up those open shots, guys. Open shot there. No, it was tipped there by Cash. He actually got it. Miss. Burke fighting for the rebounds and they get the basket 14 to 5. This is not how you want a game to start out. Nope, that's all right. Jordan pass out to his brother. Jordan's glasses come flying off. That's a foul, you know. If your glasses come flying off, it's a foul against the other team. Pretty yeah, good. they didn't count anything. At least it's not on the scoreboard yet. 
it's not like one of those. It's just like a foul that's like oh. over and back. Like it's not. Oh, I see. I got you. Yeah. And a pass from Shea Monroe goes over. It's not over. a shooting foul or anything. Right. I see. Yeah. Three and a half minutes left in this half. That has never happened to me. Yeah. I've seen it happen to Denning with the girls and Jordan a few times here with the boys. Riker has had that a couple yeah. times this game. Or last, this, yeah, the Burke game. And a couple guys tumble to the ground there. And Cloam comes up with the rebound. Hey, that's better than the, the Burke. And a pass that goes off of Cologne. I think everybody touched that ball on its way out of bounds. Oh, yeah, probably. And Burke comes up with it. Oh, and the ball knocked out of his hands by Cash Hemming. Who comes and up with the ball. Run, Cash, go. And a layup missed. And the rebound by Jonah Musser, and he's fouled on the shot. Jonah with a couple of free throws here. He was Sam's example of how to shoot a free throw, so let's see if he can do it here tonight. He was his example. Yeah, how to do it. <laughs> Did they have our voices on it? Or no, it he, muted? he muted it. And missed first shot by Jonah. Come on, bud. Second shot is no good. Rebound fought over. And it is by white Jordan ball. And, the, and a Burke player, and it ends up being Cologne Ball. Good Woo! job fighting for the ball. Sam inbounds to Tyson, brings it out to the three point line, pass over to Jonah. And he passes back to William. Back to Sam, and it goes through his hands. Cannot afford turnovers like that. No, and you can't. Burke comes down with the ball here. Pass inside. Number two shot, shot is scored. Good. 16 to 5. Pass to William Slaymaker, brings it across half court. Pass to Sam. Sam looking, passes it to Tyson. Tries to pass it. Whoops. Hit, it hit his head. Yeah, it hit off a player's head. And open three-point shot. No good. Airballed. Saved by a Burt player. And the second shot is perfect. And it's 18-5. to five. Come on, guys. Pass in just straight to a Burt player. And under the basket. And another shot. Good. In a One, timeout. 144 left in this half. 20 to 5 lead by Burke. Platt, South Dakota. If auto owners make sense for you. You've spent Winter Dental, located at 911 Golden Prairie Drive, is proud to provide Winter and the surrounding area with high quality, high tech, patient centered dentistry. Dr. Brad and the entire staff including hygienists Michaela Smith and Sierra Hansen, are honored to have the opportunity to serve the good people of Winter and the surrounding area with gentle, compassionate, and high-quality dental services. For information on all the services they can provide you or to make an appointment, please call 604. And as the Cowboys break, we've got some more basketball. It is 20 to 5 in favor of the Burke team. The Burke Cougars. Cougars. Quickly gotten out of hand here. Come on, Cash. And foul on Cougars here. Foul on number 40. They'll bring the ball in underneath us here. Jonah Musser to inbound. Cash Hemming with the shot, and it is and good. Scored. 20 to 7. And a minute and 20 seconds left in this half. 
Oh, and a stolen pass by Cologne. Cash Hemming ends up with it. He always ends up with it. Yeah. Jonah Mustard charging the basket. Pass back out to Cash. And a three-point shot. No good. Rebounded, Rebounded by, by Cash. Cash. Yell me a Coke. Okay. <laughs> and a foul on Cash on the shot. Just under a minute left in this half here. <sighs> and a perfect free throw Ooh. shot by Cash Hemming. And second shot. Bounces off the rim, rebounded by Burke. And it's a 20 to 8 game here. Pass there, almost stolen by Jordan. Rebounded. Or no, the Cougars pass it there. And a couple points. It is 22 to 8. Come on, Jonah. Pass to William. Back to Jonah. Open shot by Cash Hemming. No legs good. Hurt. It might be growing pain, so. Yeah, well, a lot of it has to do with three really long nights in a row, bud. Or growing pains. And, and or growing. Yeah. And foul on the shot. Number 22 will shoot two shots here. As the fifth foul on Cologne, but we only have 10 seconds left in the half. First shot is no good. Best kind of shot, except for uh. <laughs> Unless we're doing it. Yeah. 22 to eight. Second shot coming up. And Shots that is scored. perfect. 23 to 8, 10 seconds. Cash Hemming bringing the ball down. Six. Pass to Jonah. He shoots. In and out. No good. And that's the half. So we will take um, a little break, five minutes, and we will see you then. 842-1793 or go to winterdentalclinic.com. Lucky for us, life is full of choices, big and small. They define us, make us who we are. And when it comes time for you to choose a car, home, your next big adventure or start a new business farmers union insurance has the variety of coverage options to protect each perfect moment farmers union insurance contact your local farmers union insurance agent today lucky for us your grandmother's fine china those trendy sneakers your collection of hand carved duck decoys auto owners protects your home Because, well, somebody should. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller & Associates in Platte, South Dakota, if auto owners make sense for you. Oh, now you do your job. Core Cares helps individuals stay at home by offering caregiving, nursing, and medical alert systems in over 55 communities in South Dakota. Specializing in tasks like bathing, meal prep, and medication setups, our well-trained staff delivers exceptional care. We invest in our team through customized training and comprehensive benefits. To learn more about job opportunities or services, visit our website at corecares.com. Core Cares, proudly serving our community. Core Cares helps Schrader Electric and Control, located in Winter, is available for all your electrical service needs. With close to 40 years of experience, Brian and his crew can take care of all your electrical projects, residential or commercial. Schrader Electric works with new construction, remodels, and new additions. Call Brian at 605-840-8913 to get a quote or schedule your next electrical service. Schrader Electric and Control is a proud sponsor of the school's 
on the Live Ticket Network. Do you have a pest problem? Got bats, ants, termites? Family owned and operated, Olson's Pest Technicians have had over 50 years experience taking care of pest problems in places across South Dakota, Nebraska, and Iowa. Utilizing brilliant methods such as Centricon bait stations for termites and Vicane treatment for bed bugs, there's no pest too tough for Olson's Pest Technicians. If you have pest problems, call 800 Kill Bugs. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. Meyer Ag is your Bex Hybrids seed dealer located in Winter, South Dakota. Meyer Ag is a family-owned company specializing in seed consulting and zone-based variable rate that services South Central South Dakota. Contact Trace Meyer at 605-842-5458 to learn more about Bex Hybrids and see how Meyer Ag can make every acre count for you. Meyer Ag in Winter, South Dakota is a proud supporter of all youth athletics and activities. We connect people, have been for a hundred years or so. How we get that done? Well, that won't always be the same. But why we connect people? Not in a million years is that ever gonna change. We didn't build the communities that made South Dakota, no. We just brought them together. Being a part of a community means sharing the history and future of the people all around you. For 115 years, First Fidelity Bank has been doing just that, helping you get the most out of life by providing the services and tools you need, the conveniences and technology you want, and the friendly faces you expect. So you get everything you need right here in the place you call home, now and for many years to come. First Fidelity Bank. Being a part of a community. We hope you are all enjoying the student productions of your school. Tonight's event and every event produced by your school during the school year are created, filmed, and produced by the students you love to follow and support. Become a booster of your One, two, three, go! And as the Cowboys break, we begin the second half. The Burt Cougars will be inbounding the ball to start off the second half here. Passing the ball around. Almost knocked away by William Slaymaker and stolen by Cash Hemming. Hey, that's one way to do it. And Off loose ball leg. picked up by William, yeah. William. Chop it a few times tonight. Passes it to Sam. Passes it to Cash. Cash runs in. Shoots and misses. Miss shot. Bounced off stays. a Cougars player and it stays Cologne. Pass into Sam Bransgard, and the pass is knocked away by Burke. And it is out of bounds on Clone. Burke inbounds the ball. Passes it there. 23 runs in. Shot missed. Rebounded by Cash Hemming. <coughs> Yeah, you sound like you've had a few long days, bud. Oh, yeah, I have. And a missed shot there by Cologne, rebounded by Burke. I am here to say that I went to bed at 10.30 last night. <laughs> and I slept on a bus. 
So, you can kind of see it's kind of self-explanatory. <laughs> the experiences that make up a life, right, bud? Yep. And stolen by Cash Hemming. Pass back to Tyson Wetzel there. He passes it forward Great. and it's stolen good. by Burke. And the layup is good. 25 to 8. Lazy pass by Tyson. Stolen. So yeah, and you slept till 6.30, which you never do. No. And rebounded by Burke. Easy layup. Look at Cash. Oh, what happened to Cash? He is down. Let's take a little time out, bud, till we get this taken care of. Get the camera off of him here. I'm not sure what happened. So we'll take a little break. Live event coverage by becoming a sponsor. It's a great way to show your support of the athletes and students in your community. As a sponsor, you'll get great visibility for your business, organization, or family by supporting the live productions of your school. Wow, Bill, you're walking so much better. What did you do? Well, I got so tired of the pain and nearly fell. And one of my friends recommended physical therapy at Winter Physical Therapy. And you know what? My back also stopped hurting. Huh. So how did you get started? My doctor wrote me a referral, but that's not always needed. Turns out you always have a choice where you want to go. So why did you choose Winter Physical Therapy? I love to support our locally owned small businesses. And quite frankly, they give great personalized care. Winter Physical Therapy. Exceptional care. The right nutrition, animal health, and record management is key to having a profitable cattle program. That's why you want to work with the people at FarmCo, who will take the time to learn your operation and help you grow your business. We are your full-service agriculture provider of feed, seed, animal health, farm, and ranching equipment built on terrific service. Get to know FarmCo locally owned and serving you in Chamberlain, Platt, Winter, and east of Kimball at the Paragon. Visit us online at farmcosd.com. FarmCo, Farm feeding, feeding your future. Your future. Future. Early seed season is here. Liftoff Seed carries Hefty brand corn and beans for their genetics, technology, and treatments. Hefty's corn has been very drought tolerant and an excellent. And we are back after the Cash Hemming incident. He is still in pain. <clears throat> yeah, they're having to wipe up the floor there. Why? Yeah, sweat probably. Yeah, yeah. it looks like he was hit in the Stomach. upper abdomen. That yeah, would have knocked his wind out. Yeah, he is in some pain, it looks like. Probably smacked something. Yeah, I hit somebody's elbow. Or knee. Yeah, so Jonah must have bringing the ball down for the Cowboys. Charge the basket, pass out to Sam Bransgard, and it is out of bounds. You can First tell he's ball. mad. Yep. It's a 27-8 game. Cash walking into the office there to be looked at. Burt comes down with the ball. And a significantly diminished Cologne team now. Oh yeah, like we have, we need cash. Yep. Burke around the three-point line, and the shot is no Missed. good. And Tyson Wetzel gets up in a hurry. Yeah, it, was, it looked like it was out on him, fighting for the ball. He's a big guy, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Three-point shot by Burke again, and, and the ball is stuck. stuck. One thing after another, I swear. Jonah knocks the ball loose. Cash will probably come back. Yeah, he, he looks like he'll be all right eventually. 7-16 left in this quick game. They gave game. him some ice. Yeah. I'm going to say it was an elbow in the belly. And a stolen pass by Burke and a fast break here. Foul on the shot. And the Burke player is down now. Will you guys stop injuring each other? <laughs> Jonah had some contact there. 
I know you guys hate each other, but you don't have to fight. <laughs> and it looks like a technical call there. I know you guys don't like each other. You don't have to fight about it. We already <laughs> know. And I'm not sure it's that. Just playing. And he misses his first shot. Second shot coming up. And he shot makes that. Scored. And it will be Burke Ball here. I wonder what the technical was over. I don't know. It was something with like two guys or something. Match. I'll have or to find out unsportsmanlike tomorrow. conduct, maybe. Maybe. I'll find out after the game. I think Emmy's here. I'll ask her. She'll know. She's Is basketball her sport? No, yeah, she seems to know an awful lot about it. I'll just yeah. give you that. Burke inbounds. Passed around the three-point line. And a three-point shot. No Missed. good. Rebounded, Rebounded by Jonah Musser. And a foul called on Burke. Number two with a foul. And Jonah will inbound the ball here. Come on, Jonah. And shot is no good. Rebounded by Burke. They bring the ball down. Open shoot. Oh, I thought he was going to shoot it there. Is Ca Cash is still on the sidelines? Yep. Three point Bench. shot, no good. Rebounded by Burke. And that shot is no good. Rebounded by Burke. And that shot is no good. And rebounded by Cologne. Jordan Musser with the rebound. Jonah with a shot missed. And rebounded, rebounded by, by Burke. Burke. Drinks you owe me a Coke. <laughs> Our Cokes will cancel each other out. How's that? Open right. shot. No good. Rebounded by Burke. And that shot no good. Jonah Musser with the grab that time. Jonah passed to Sam. Back to Jonah. And, and there she scored. Plays. Finally, 28-10. And timeout called by Burke. So we'll take a little break as well. We also have Enlist and Extendiflex soybeans for your choice in herbicide. With Dynagro, we're at the top of the South Dakota field trials for their sunflowers and milo. And with Millbarn, we're the leader in grass, cover, crop, and forages. Call 605-840-4591 for Litaw Seed, your source for corn to cover crops, soybeans to sunflowers, and all forages. That's 605-840-4591. Early seed... The innocence of youth. Is there anything any better? But soon they'll be in high school and facing all the same challenges you faced. How to make friends. How to fit in. How to be cool. And as Burke breaks, Cowboys break as well. And it is Burke ball with five and a half minutes left. And his long two-pointer. Missed. Missed. I think it was tipped, probably. William Slaymaker comes up with the rebound. Come on, William. Passes Pass to, to Tyson. Tyson. Come on, Tyson. Oh, missed shot. Rebounded by Burke, and they bring the ball down in a hurry. Bunch of bodies flying everywhere. This is what happens in a clone game. People fall. A couple people yeah, three, get injured. A couple guys people die. Floor. You know, our death rate's getting up there, you know. <laughs> You're reading about it in the papers. Things you never thought you would say. Yeah. <laughs> Under the basket and another foul on Cologne. Guys, we know you hate each other. You don't have to fight about it. Five minutes left. That's why they are fighting, right? Well, yeah. 
<laughs> but inbound by Burke. Uh, pass under the basket. And <laughs> foul on Bodie Kingsley. Bodie? Yep. And number 24 will get a couple shots here. And missed shot his first missed. shot at the back of the rim. Shot number two coming up. No good. Rebounded by Tyson Wetzel. Tyson yelling at the players. I think the players didn't realize what was going on. Nobody there for him to pass it to. He's taken after his, uh, his dad. He, he yells on the sideline a lot. Oh, yeah. It's oh, kind of pass mishandled by Bodie Kingsley. And a layup by Burke uh -huh. makes it 30 to 10. That is just sad. Yep. I don't get parents who yell at their kids. I just couldn't do something like well, that. Well, you yell at our, at <laughs> me during baseball. I yell endlessly at Abraham during baseball. Come on, Bear. Come on, Bear. Quit your whining. <laughs> Quit crying, boy. <laughs> Cash still has not made his way back. Yeah, I don't think he'll be back out to the varsity game. Yeah, Abraham's nickname is Bear, and if you come and watch one of his baseball games, all you hear is Bear. Some guy just keeps yelling at him. Won't yeah. leave him alone. That guy's totally not my dad. Nope. But it's encouraging stuff, mostly. Calm down, Bear. You're all right. My dad's nickname for me is now Secret. <laughs> and Burke with the... Shot missed. Shot missed. Bunch of guys Rebounded. slamming into the wall there. That kid has the mullet going on. Bunch of missed shots and rebounds by Burke. And, and finally they get one scored. in. 32 to 10. And the ball stolen from Jonah Musser. Travel called, though. The Cougars? Yep. Travel on the Cougars, it is. Cowboy ball. Yeah, Abraham's quite the baseball pitcher. He had uh, he pitched 24 innings last year and gave up one earned run. He's really pretty good. So I'm yelling encouraging things. He doesn't, he doesn't get any bad mouthing from me in the middle of the game. I'm not like those stereotypical kids. Yeah, yeah. Foul committed against Jonah Musser on there. And let's see if we can get a couple more shots here, Jonah. 32 to 10, three minutes left in this game. Jonah Musser getting ready to shoot. And it bounces off the rim. That's the story of all Clum shots. Bounces <laughs> off the rim. Come on, Jonah. And bounces off the rim. Rebounded by Jordan. And, and a foul call. Hold. Foul called against number two for Burke against Jonah Musser. Or Jonah will, or Jordan Musser, rather. Jordan will have a couple shots. Future Marine and last night's cameraman. Come on, Jordan. Perfect Shots shot. Good. Perfect shot. Jordan ships out May the 28th. He and I were talking about that yesterday. I said, man, that's just three months from now. <laughs> Yeah. He said, yep, 13 weeks. And it is white ball. Out on the Cougars. Hey, hey, 
And pass into Sam Bransgard. Oh, pass knocked away by the Cougars, and Sam just charges it. Knocks the kid down. <laughs> pass to Tyson. Come on, Tyson. Oh, and Jordan gets it and puts yeah. it in. Yeah. Woo. What a play. That was, I'm going to have to talk to Sam about that tomorrow. Good job, Sam. I got to move my camera here. Made everybody sick. Three point shot is good. It's 35 13. Kind of looks like our game. Yeah, it does, unfortunately. Pass to jo uh, Jordan. He misses it. Shot by Shea Monroe. Missed. You know, when we say it looks like our game, it's not a good thing. Not usually. Not usually a good sign, I hate to say. No. But you guys have gotten a lot better, I will say that. And number 21 will be shooting for Burke. He's got a couple shots coming. He's the first one is good. He plays for the junior high team. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's, you see those jerseys? Oh, yeah, it is a different jersey, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Those are the ones that they wear. I think he's 7th and 8th grade. And his second shot is no good. It rebounded by Jordan Musser. Passes it to Shea. Just under two minutes left in this game here. Go, Shea, go, go. Pass to Tyson, who turns around and misses the shot. And the second shot is good! Oh! Finally! 36-15. Tyson gets some points there. And they had a sub come in. Not sure what exactly was going on. I don't know. And a jump ball called. And it is Burke ball here. I don't know what the heck is happening sometimes. Yes. <laughs> Last night in the girls game, something. I don't remember what it was going on. <laughs> I, re I just said, what the heck is going on here? And Jordan couldn't answer because he was laughing too hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and Burke ends up, uh, Cloman ended up committing a foul there. Burke, <laughs> number 40, is shooting. No good. <laughs> Bounces off the back of the rim. I've got my legs up on the chair. Yeah, hey, chill out, bud. He's had a very, very long week. Oh, yeah. Number 40 with a second shot. And it is good. 37-15. The game is winding down. Last minute and a half. And it's stolen pass from Shane Monroe. And a fast break layup misses. Rebounded by Tyson Wetzel. He fought for that thing. I would not want to be in his way when he's spinning around like that. Oh, no. <laughs> he's a train and you're the, you're the canoe. <laughs> yeah. And a stolen ball by, by Cougars. A foul, it looks, on Clome. And we have got number 23 getting some shots here. We are right at one minute left in this game. 59.8 seconds. First shot, no good. Second shot, no good, and rebounded by Burke, and that shot is no good. Knocked out of bounds by Tyson Wetzel. He full on hammered that thing out. Yep. Tyson's nose is bleeding. Tyson's nose is bleeding, and there is a timeout called. Is there any blood on the court? 
Uh, I don't see any. That's I what we like. Yeah, I thought I saw it coming out of his nose. He reached up, and yeah, there's obviously blood there. Really? On the yeah. court? Where? No, not on the court. Oh. On his hand. We like action. Especially injuries, we love that stuff. <laughs> what? <laughs> We love to watch people suffer. No. <laughs> no kid. Oh. 55.6 seconds left in this game. It looks like Bodie came in for Tyson. And Tyson comes out of the <laughs> comes out of the office with Kleenex on his nose. A and Kleenex, a shot there. You know. Makes it 39-15. Should be able to see Tyson in the back there. <laughs> oh, and a blocked shot, or a blocked pass, rather. And Burt gets an, another couple score. points here, 41-15. Well, it's tough when everybody's six inches taller than you. Tyson doesn't feel too good, I don't think. And another pass stolen by Burke and... Uh, missed. missed shot and a foul. 16 seconds. Come on. Really? Why you do that? Oh, guys, come on. 41-15. Two shots for number 18. First Bridge. shot bounces off the back of the rim. 18 also played with the junior high. Yeah, yeah, I see a uniform now. He also shot like three of them in a row. for um, so. And a perfect shot there, 42-15. And this game is just about to wrap up. Shane Monroe bringing the ball down for us. Go, Shay, go, come on. And the pass taken by Burke, and they just hold it for the last second. And that is the end of the game. Congratulations to the JV boys from Burke for the 42 to 15 win. Stick around, and we will have the varsity boys here. I'm not sure how much long. About 15 minutes. The clock is showing, but doesn't necessarily mean anything. Nope. Just stick around, and the game will commence when it's when it commences. Right, Bud? Yep. Aren't we having parents night, though? It is parents night tonight. Are they going to do that right now? Uh, I'm not sure. I think they'll do that at the beginning of the varsity game. That's what they did with the girls. Tonight is parents night here in Cologne. All right. So and we, will we will take a break. Go ahead, bud. I'll be quiet. We will see you then. We want our children to have everything they'll need to live fulfilling and productive lives. Make sure the kids in your family are among the more than 57,000 participants here in South Dakota who take part in high school sports or activities. No job is too big or small for the gang at h and Electric in winter. Whether it's a simple task around the house, remodel, new addition, or new construction, we provide residential, commercial, and industrial heating, cooling, or electrical work in winter and the surrounding area. We handle it all. Call 605-842-1117 for service or more information on your next project, big or small. h and Electric is your authorized dealer for train heating systems, too. Good luck in today's event. h and Electric is a proud supporter of all area student-athletes and activities on Live Ticket TV. No job is too If you have a Grossenberg custom calendar, now is the month you can have some fun and get a free can of John Deere glass cleaner. How is that, you may ask? Take the maze challenge on the February calendar, complete it from start to end, and bring it in to one of Grossenberg's nine locations, parts departments, and receive one free can of John Deere glass cleaner. Grossenberg Implement is your John Deere location for fun and savings. Offer only valid for one customer per month. Must present a copy or the actual completed maze to qualify. See parts staff for complete details. John Deere glass cleaner part number TY25. If you have a gross Just as you aim to reach new heights on the field or court, Elevate Agronomics is here to help you do the same on your farm. Putting together a solid plan for each customer is the goal at Elevate, so you can win all season long. 
with a full lineup of field seeds, including corn, soybeans, alfalfa, sorghum, forage, cover crops, wildlife habitat, and more, along with a full line of chemicals and plant health products, Elevate is ready to put your plans into action. Check us out at elevateagronomics.com or stop by the office in winter today. Elevate Agronomics, reach new heights. Your local cooperative has a new name. CHS Northern Plains and CHS Midwest Cooperative have joined together to better serve you under the new name CHS River Plains. You gain more options and more value with access to global markets in a powerful supply chain. And And for everybody at home, I don't think I've ever gotten a shot of him hip up here. This is your announcer, Abraham, wearing his lucky necklace and his L.A. Dodgers shirt or Dodgers hat. So, so we got to say anything to say, bud? Go Cowboys! Go Cowboys. <laughs> so I, they, I was expecting them to do this right before the varsity game, but. They kicked it in right then, so that's fine. And I wanted to give everybody at home a glimpse of the uh, Coloma announcer that we've gotten so many good comments about. So we are going to continue our break until the varsity game begins. Looks like it'll be about 15 minutes or so. You can do more every day using inputs delivered by a team who knows what you need, when you need it. Visit us online at chsriverplains.com or stop in today and let us help you own every day your first car. It might not have been perfect, but that didn't matter. You loved it because you worked hard for it. You took care of it and it took care of you, your friends, and maybe that someone special. And through it all, we were there working with you, for you, to make sure it was a smooth ride. Farmers Union Insurance. More choices, great rates, local agents. Contact your local Farmers Union Insurance agent today. 
Shop local with Burke and Gregory Building Centers, your hometown hardware stores, specializing in everything from finding the right drill bit to building your dream home. The crew at Burke and Gregory Building Centers take pride in customer service and are always available to help with any project, big or small. They offer top-of-the-line flooring and cabinetry, a large inventory of rental items, quality Pittsburgh paint, and so much more. Follow them on Facebook and shop online anytime at bgbuildingcenter.com. At American Family Insurance, we help protect what you've achieved so you can fearlessly go after your dreams. For auto, home, business, and life, contact us today. American Family Insurance. Insure carefully, dream fearlessly. American Family Insurance, Life Mutual Standard of Ohio and Wisconsin Company, 6000 American Parkway, Madison, Wisconsin, 53783. Agrimax and West River Ag have been in the winter area for a combined total of nine years. We offer top-of-the-line services and inputs such as chemical, seed, fertilizer application, spraying, and agronomy services with a certified crop advisor on staff. We are a full-service business that is locally owned and operated. We look forward to continuing service to the ag community and cannot wait to help you with all your agricultural needs. Agrimax, shaping the future of ag. This is what matters. This is beyond X's and O's. This is the difference mutual respect makes. This is what character looks like. This is what defines us in South Dakota. This is sportsmanship. School sports, it's not the outcome that matters most, but the way the games are played. This message presented by the South Dakota High School Activities Association and the South Dakota Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association. Is your team or organization looking to improve their look? Are you looking for quality custom apparel with fast, friendly service from people you can trust? Then contact Apparel Works in Wagner, South Dakota. They can provide you with all kinds of options of screen printing or embroidery on your team's new uniforms or your office wear. Apparel Works is also the place to pick up your promotional items such as koozies, pens, and magnets. Contact their knowledgeable and friendly staff today at 605-384-3553 or visit their website at apparelworkssd.com. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. You've spent years dreaming up your business plan, saving every dollar, searching for the right location, and perfecting your product. Auto Owners insures your small business, because it isn't small to you. Only 36 more to go. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller & Associates in Platte, South Dakota, if Auto Owners makes sense for you. You've spent years... Winter Dental, located at 911 Golden Prairie Drive, is proud to provide Winter and the surrounding area with high-quality, high-tech, patient-centered dentistry. Dr. Brad and the entire staff, including hygienists Michaela Smith and Sierra Hansen, are honored to have the opportunity to serve the good people of Winter and the surrounding area with gentle, compassionate, and high-quality dental services. For information on all the services they can provide you or to make an appointment, please call 605-842-1793 or go to winterdentalclinic.com. Lucky for us, life is full of choices, big and small. They define us, make us who we are. And when it comes time for you to choose a car, home, your next big adventure or start a new business farmers union insurance has the variety of coverage options to protect each perfect moment farmers union insurance contact your local farmers union insurance agent today lucky for us 
Your grandmother's fine china, those trendy sneakers, your collection of hand-carved duck decoys. Auto Owners protects your home. Because, well, somebody should. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller and Associates in Platte, South Dakota, if auto owners make sense for you. Oh, now you do your job. Core Cares helps individuals stay at home by offering caregiving, nursing, and medical alert systems in over 55 communities in South Dakota. Specializing in tasks like bathing, meal prep, and medication setups, our well-trained staff delivers exceptional care. We invest in our team through customized training and comprehensive benefits. To learn more about job opportunities or services, visit our website at corecares.com. Core Cares, proudly serving our community. Core Cares helps. Schrader Electric and Control, located in Winter, is available for all your electrical service needs. With close to 40 years of experience, Brian and his crew can take care of all your electrical projects, residential or commercial. Schrader Electric works with new construction, remodels, and new additions. Call Brian at 605 840 8913 to get a quote or schedule your next electrical service. Schrader Electric and Control is a proud sponsor of the school's on the Live Ticket Network. Do you have a pest problem? Got bats, ants, termites? Family owned and operated, Olson's Pest Technicians have had over 50 years experience taking care of pest problems in places across South Dakota, Nebraska, and Iowa. Utilizing brilliant methods, such as Centricon bait stations for termites and Vicane treatment for bed bugs, there's no pest too tough for Olson's Pest Technicians. If you have pest problems, call 800-KILL-BUGS. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. Meyer Ag is your Bex Hybrids seed dealer located in Winter, South Dakota. Meyer Ag is a family-owned company specializing in seed consulting and zone-based variable rate that services South Central South Dakota. Contact Trace Meyer at 605-842-5458 to learn more about Bex Hybrids and see how Meyer Ag can make every acre count for you. Meyer Ag in Winter, South Dakota is a proud supporter of all youth athletics and activities. We connect people. Have been for a hundred years or so. How we get that done? Well, that won't always be the same. But why we connect people? Not in a million years is that ever gonna change. We didn't build the communities that made South Dakota, no. We just brought them together. Being a part of a community means sharing the history and future of the people all around you. For 115 years, First Fidelity Bank has been doing just that, helping you get the most out of life by providing the services and tools you need the conveniences and technology you want, and the friendly faces you expect. So you get everything you need right here in the place you call home. Now and for many years to come. First Fidelity Bank. Being a part of a community. We hope you are all enjoying the student productions of your school. Tonight's event and every event produced by your school during the school year are created, filmed, and produced by the students you love to follow and support. Become a booster of your school's live event coverage by becoming a sponsor. It's a great way to show your support of the athletes and students in your community. As a sponsor, you'll get great visibility for your business, organization, or family by supporting the live productions of your school. 
Wow, Bill, you're walking so much better. What did you do? Well, I got so tired of the pain and nearly fell. And one of my friends recommended physical therapy at Winter Physical Therapy. And you know what? My back also stopped hurting. Huh. So how did you get started? My doctor wrote me a referral, but that's not always needed. Turns out you always have a choice where you want to go. So why did you choose Winter Physical Therapy? I love to support our locally owned small businesses. And quite frankly, they give great personalized care. Winter Physical Therapy. Exceptional care. The right nutrition, animal health, and record management is key to having a profitable cattle program. That's why you want to work with the people at FarmCo, who will take the time to learn your operation and help you grow your business. We are your full-service agriculture provider of feed, seed, animal health, farm, and ranching equipment built on terrific service. Get to know FarmCo locally owned and serving you in Chamberlain, Platte, Winter, and east of Kimball at the Paragon. Visit us online at FarmCoSD.com. FarmCo, Farm feeding, feeding your future. Your future. Early seed season is here. Litaw Seed carries Hefty brand corn and beans for their genetics, technology, and treatments. Hefty's corn has been very drought tolerant and an excellent yielding. We also have Enlist and Extendiflex soybeans for your choice in herbicide. With Dynagro, we're at the top of the South Dakota field trials for their sunflowers and milo. And with Millbarn, we're the leader in grass, cover, crop, and forages. Call 605-840-4591 for Litaw Seed, your source for corn to cover crops, soybeans to sunflowers, and all forages. That's 605-840-4591. Early the innocence of youth. Is there anything any better? But soon they'll be in high school and facing all the same challenges you faced. How to make friends. How to fit in. How to be cool. We want our children to have everything they'll need to live fulfilling and productive lives. Make sure the kids in your family are among the more than 57,000 participants here in South Dakota who take part in high school sports or activities. No job is too big or small for the gang at h and Electric in winter. Whether it's a simple task around the house, remodel, new addition, or new construction, we provide residential, commercial, and industrial heating, cooling, or electrical work in winter and the surrounding area. We handle it all. Call 605-842-1117 for service or more information on your next project, big or small. h and Electric is your authorized dealer for train heating systems, too. Good luck in today's event. h and Electric is a proud supporter of all area student athletes and activities on Live Ticket TV. No job is too If you have a Grossenberg custom calendar, now is the month you can have some fun and get a free can of John Deere glass cleaner. How is that, you may ask? Take the maze challenge on the February calendar, complete it from start to end, and bring it in to one of Grossenberg's nine locations, parts departments, and receive one free can of John Deere glass cleaner. Grossenberg Implement is your John Deere location for fun and savings. Offer only valid for one customer per month. Must present a copy or the actual completed maze to qualify. See parts staff for complete details. John Deere glass cleaner part number TY25. If you have a gross Just as you aim to reach new heights on the field or court, Elevate Agronomics is here to help you do the same on your farm. Putting together a solid plan for each customer is the goal at Elevate, so you can win all season long. With a full lineup of field seeds, including corn, soybeans, alfalfa, sorghum, forage, cover crops, wildlife habitat, and more, along with a full line of chemicals and plant health products, Elevate is ready to put your plans into action. Check us out at elevateagronomics.com or stop by the office in winter today. Elevate Agronomics, reach new heights. Your local cooperative has a new name. CHS Northern Plains and CHS Midwest Cooperative have joined together to better serve you under the new name CHS River Plains. You gain more options and more value with access to global markets and a powerful supply chain. And you can do more every day using inputs delivered by a team who knows what you need, when you need it. Visit us online at chsriverplains.com or stop in today and let us help you own every day. Your first car. It might not have been perfect, but that didn't matter. You loved it because you worked hard for it. You took care of it and it took care of you, your friends, and maybe that someone special. And through it all, we were there working with you, for you, to make sure it was a smooth ride. Farmers Union Insurance. More choices, great rates, local agents. Contact your local Farmers Union Insurance agent today. Shop local with Burke and Gregory Building Centers, your hometown hardware stores, specializing in everything from finding the right drill bit to building your dream home. 
The crew at Burke and Gregory Building Centers take pride in customer service and are always available to help with any project, big or small. They offer top-of-the-line flooring and cabinetry, a large inventory of rental items, quality Pittsburgh paint, and so much more. Follow them on Facebook and shop online anytime at bgbuildingcenter.com. At American Family Insurance, we help protect what you've achieved so you can fearlessly go after your dreams. For auto, home, business, and life, contact us today. American Family Insurance.
at the tip off. We've got Cowboys versus the Cougars. We've um, got Jonah Musser jumping for Coloma, number 44, jumping for the Cougars. And the game has started, and it's out on the Cougars. I don't think we introduced ourselves tonight, bud. Nope. My name is Abraham. I'm a fifth grader. And I am Wes. I'm a high school English teacher. I'm 11. And I no. am not. No. Nope. <laughs> Good answer. I'm working on being 25. Long three-pointer by Joseph Lappers missed and rebounded by Burt, but lost of control bounds. of it. And it is Cologne Ball. That's the best out of bounds. Another yeah, team. absolutely. Seth Heath inbound for us. Pass oh. to Jonah under the basket. And he gets a couple shots early here in the game. Come on, Jonah. Perfect Ooh. shot. Perfect shot. One nothing. That's what our the score of the soccer game we played in gym was. <laughs> Literally. Rebounded the missed second shot. Merck rebounded. They come down the court for their first possession. I gotta get on the other side of the camera here. It happens. Getting all tied up in these cords here. Burke will inbound the ball. Three-point shot is good for Burke, and that's a 3-1 game. Two-point game. And a quick pass down to Jonah. Back over to Seth Heath with a three-pointer of his own, and he misses. Rebounded by Burke. And a quick layup makes it 5-1. That was just a bullet pass. It, it was. Yeah. Joseph Lapith pass to Seth Heath. Out to Jordan. He misses a long shot there. Also known as completely air ball. But it was a bit of an air ball. Just a bit. Shot and foul. Fouled on the shot. And number 10 will go to the line for Burke. It's a 5 1 lead early for Burke here. His first shot is perfect. Good. 6 to 1. Shot number two coming. Hey, Dad, are we walking home? Yeah. I like when we Seven walk home. one early in the game here. Jack Anderson bringing the ball down. Passes to Joseph, and it went oh. through Joseph's hand, and it is Burke's ball again. No, no, apparently it was tipped. Woo. That's always good. There's two turnovers Burke has given us here. And we so far have not capitalized. Burke ball, and they come down the court quickly. Long pass under the basket. Spin shot does not go. Rebounded by Jack Anderson. Jack rebounds like a machine. Yeah, he's really good at it. Being 6'3 helps. He's a post, for sure. Jonah Musser charging towards the basket. Pass back out to Joseph. I oh, did learn Joseph all the terms. I did learn all the terms of basketball, like most of the positions. Yeah. You got two guards and two posts and a point guard. Long pass by... Joseph to Jonah and, Jonah and foul. Is he is so good again. at getting foul. Yeah, well, he runs in there and he draws the fouls. It's yeah. a 9 1 game. 
But he knows exactly when to shoot to get the foul. Yeah. First shot is beautiful. Absolutely perfect shot. Nine to two. Cash Hemming coming in for Jordan Musser. Good to see Cash back on the court. And bounces off the rim, and they let it go out of bounds. It is Burke Ball. Nine to two lead for the Cougars here. Three point shot, no good. Rebounded by Jonah Musser, who passes to nobody, essentially. I'm not sure who he was throwing it to. Oh, that's a travel, come on. Clone ball. I cannot hear myself in my earphones here. Well, too bad. <laughs> pass out to Jack Anderson. <laughs> Cross the court to Cash, he misses a shot. Rebounded by Burke, but thrown away. Cash Hemming comes up with it. Shot Jonah, missed. Come Jonah on, missed. Guys. And foul. Burke. No jump ball called. It is Burke ball. It is Burke Should be Cologne because they touched it first and then it went out of bounds. Yeah, they had, well, I guess they technically would say that what they didn't have possession of it. It just went out on them. He technically had possession, but. <laughs> hypothetical now. That's exactly right. And stolen by Jack Anderson. Slows the game Good play down. there by Jack. Pass to Jonah Musser. Brings the ball down for us. Joseph Lapith looking for a three. Jump ball. Or jump shot. But three seconds in the lane. Uh, it is Cougar ball. Burke will have the ball, or possession of the ball again. Poor Emmy, she's just walking around limping like crazy. Yeah, yeah, she told me today she sprained her foot. It's only a sprain? Yep. She was limping around on it this morning. Pass stolen by Didn't Cologne. she have crutches? She did have a crutch with her, yep. Just one? Yeah, just one, I saw. And Jack shot rebounds. By Come on, guys. There you go. Nine to four. Seth put that one up. And a three-point shot. No good. Rebounded by Burke. Another three. And they just let him shoot it. Why didn't anyone run up the garden? Twelve to four. Dude just sat there for three seconds with the ball in his hand. Squaring it up. 12 to 4. And there he goes again. And fouled on the shot. Uh, don't line it up. No. He gets three. Lucky. Three shots. I'm tired. <laughs> Just the first quarter, bud. I know, that's the problem. And the first shot is no good. Woo! Just keep it up like that. Doing great. Burke has seemed to have a little bit of trouble shooting the free throws tonight. Of course, I say that and he makes the next one. 13 to mm -hmm. 4. Not what you want. Nine point lead for Burke. And his third shot coming up. Don't you dare make it, man. Misses. Ha. Huh. Out of bounds on Jonah Musser. And it is Burke Ball. Burke Ball. I'm in my whole other world right now. Yeah. <laughs> I am zoned out. You seem a bit tired, bud. Three-point shot. No good. And 
Rebounded by Cologne. Cash Hemming comes up with it. Joseph Lapper saved it from going out of bounds. And missed shot there, but I think it was Jonah shoot. And Burke with the layup, and it is good. 15 to 4. Pass to Cash Hemming. Back to Joseph. That's not Cash, that's Seth. Oh, it is Seth. My mistake. And a fast break by Burke and another layup. And timeout called by Colm, and we'll take a short break too. Sure carefully, dream fearlessly. American Family Insurance, Life Mutual, Standard of Ohio, Wisconsin Company, 6000 American Parkway, Madison, Wisconsin, 53783. Agrimax and West River Ag have been in the winter area for a combined total of nine years. We offer top-of-the-line services and inputs such as chemical, seed, fertilizer application, spraying, and agronomy services with a certified crop advisor on staff. We are a full-service business that is locally owned and operated. We look forward to continuing service to the ag community and cannot wait to help you with all your agricultural needs. Agrimax, shaping the future of ag. This is what matters. One. This is beyond. And we are back. It is Cologne Ball here. Two forty-four left in the first quarter. Loose ball recovered by Cologne. Joseph Lapper for the shot. Foul. Foul on Joseph. That's not what we want to do. Sink it, Joseph. Just make the hoop pitiful. There hey. you go. First shot is good. 17 to 4. 5, Five. brother. How dare you <laughs> get a point. Second shot is Woo. good, too. And oh. bounce off the back of the rim. Missed shot by Burke. And, and it is white ball. Committed. Four fouls for both teams. 219 left in the quarter here. Cecil end up being a six foot. Because <laughs> don't you still grow? <laughs> Don't you still grow until like 25? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, it varies on everybody. I sure didn't grow. Well, yeah, you never grew. <laughs> You're still a kid on the outside. I know, foul committed by Burke. It is Jack Anderson coming to the line here. Yeah, they introduced Seth tonight as five foot twelve. <laughs> <laughs> Just give it to him. I'll have Come to on. go and stand beside him tomorrow and just see just how tall he is. He's probably taller than they say. Man, the first shot is perfect for Jack Anderson. Beautiful shot there. 17 to 7. Shot number two coming up. Yeah, it's off the back of the rim. Burke running down quickly. Pass and open three point shot. No good. Rebounded by Cologne. Seth Heath with the rebound. Jack Anderson passes, almost threw it away. Saved by Jonah Musser. No more throwing it away. And Come on, guys. Shot by Jack. You guys can't be doing that, you know. Burke charges with the layup and misses. Rebounded by Jonah Musser. Couple bodies on the floor there. Joseph Lapworth with a three. Misses. Not sure what the call was. The 
push. It was a foul on uh, I think, Jack Anderson. I think Jack said at the end, I can't box out. Yeah. Third foul for Jack. Three-point shot, no good. And Clum lets it go out of bounds. And Jordan Musser coming in for Jack. One minute left in this quarter. Joseph brings the ball down. Has to catch Hemming, long three-pointer, and does oh. not go, but rebounded by Jonah. Back to Seth. Charges toward the basket. Shot blocked. Uh, recovered by Seth. Pass blocked, but recovered by Cologne. These shoes are squeaking Come so on, bad. Seth. Oh. oh, and the ball rolls around the rim. It's infuriating how often that happens. The hoops, our own hoops hate us. The baskets do not like us. And a foul. That was Joseph. It is Burt shooting. He just Number. full on pushed him. Happened. Number two with some shots here. We like action, seeing people fall. 17 seconds left in this quarter. I'm t -t tired. Yeah, you sound exhausted, but. That's one word to say it. To say. Ooga booga. And coach gets a warning here from the ref. Was it Dustin? Yeah. And a missed first shot, bounces off the rim. And the second shot is no good. Rebounded by Burke, though. Pass out to three, three, and he runs and shoots and misses and recovered by Jonah Musser. Ha! Recovered, rebounded by Jonah. Five seconds left. Come on, Joseph. And missed the shot. Unleash the Kraken. 17 to seven as we go into the second quarter. And we will see you in just a few minutes. X's and O's. This is the difference mutual respect makes. This is what character looks like. This is what defines us in South Dakota. This is sportsmanship. School sports, it's not the outcome that matters most, but the way the games are played. This message presented by the South Dakota High School Activities Association and the South Dakota Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association. Is your team or organization looking to improve their look? Are you looking for quality custom apparel with fast, friendly service from people you can trust? Then contact Apparel Works in Wagner, South Dakota. They can provide you with all kinds of options of screen printing. And here we are. It is Cologne Ball, I think. Yep. Seth inbounding the cash here. See, we have like three point guards and Joseph with a blocked shot foul. is foul. And he will go to the line. Ha ha ha. Foul the bird. number two. They don't like that when he gets fouled because he <laughs> makes them all. He makes a good percentage of them, that's for sure. Just like that, 17 to 8. Come on, Joseph. And his second shot is perfect. 17 to 9 game. Burke to inbound here. Cross half court. Open three pointer. And a no good. Rebounded by Burke. Missed the, re the second shot. And they throw it back out again. And a foul on Cash Hemming. Sorry, my legs hurt really bad. It's like a pain that will not go. 
It's called Abraham being tired. Yeah, when I get to a certain point, I, my legs start aching me too. Yeah. Inbound to <coughs> number 44, Burke, and a travel call. And Cologne ends up with the ball here. Uh, just don't throw it away. Yeah, That's the one a, thing you can't do. Get a good shot off here. Joseph Lapras on the three-point line runs up and draws the foul again. That's he is how you good do at it. that. That's how you do it. He's not scared of anything, I swear. No, he's a good player. Come on, Joseph. Perfect. Woo! 17 to 10. I'm going to start trying to pay attention more. <laughs> Abraham catching some Z's over here. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Joseph. Second shot is great. 17 11. <sighs> 40 seconds, jo and Joseph's drawn two fouls off of Burke. Not bad. Burke inbounds the ball here. Pass stolen by Joseph Lapras. The layup is good. It's 17 13. This is his last game ever. Yep. Come on. Missed layup. Rebounded by Cologne. Uh, out of bounds. Uh, I still have it Seven. down as the first quarter. 17 to 13. I figure people will forgive you, bud. I'm so sorry. I'm tired. <laughs> and a three-point shot. No good. A push. Foul on Burke. Cologne ball. It is Cologne ball. Three team fouls for Burke this quarter. Three team. Oh. Three fouls. Oh, I thought I I heard you as three teen, and I was oh. like, what? <laughs> what the and heck is he talking about? And the pass is stolen by Burke. And a travel call. Woo! Here you go. This is becoming kind of a game. It's Never a four thought point it game, would, man. but. And Joseph's pass is blocked by Burke, but it goes right back into his hands. And another pass stolen by Burke. And, and a pass stolen, stolen, stolen by Joseph. And a running shot. Woo! And it's 17 15. That was like my shot yesterday. One of them. Burke charges the basket, and the, it is blocked and taken by Cologne. Cash Hemming with the ball. Pass to Seth Heath. This is our chance to tie it here. Joseph with the long three 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 three. shot. 18 18-17. 18-17. Unanswered points by Cologne. 18? It was 17-8. And then we scored 10 straight points. That's what we needed there. Sorry for screaming. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I scream all the time, don't worry. Remember that playoff game we had? Oh yeah, oh yeah. I was screaming like crazy. <laughs> Eighteen seventeen Cowboys lead. Man, this is when it really matters. Yeah. The seniors on this team. Um, Jordan, Jack, Joseph. It's their last and, game. Yeah, this is their last game unless they have playoffs. But yep. this is the last game we do that yep. they will ever play in. 
Yeah, long pass to Burke, long pass under the basket, and they bring it back out to the three-point line. Jump shot foul. Oh. Both coaches yelling at their players. Two shots for number 30. First shot First is shot scores. is good, and we have a tied game. Come on, guys. Joseph is really good at those three-pointers. Mm -hmm. Second shot is good, and Burke has regained the lead, 19-18. Joseph Lapworth brings the ball down, sets up for a three, and he is fouled. Oh, three shots, Joseph Lapworth. Wait, if you make a three-pointer but you get fouled on it, do you only shoot one? You can make it a four-point thing. Let's say you were down three yeah. in a playoff game, you shoot a three, yep. get fouled. Come on, Joseph. Beautiful, we have a tied game again. Joseph. Perfect. Woo! 20 to 19. He can just Cologne prove leads. people wrong. Like, I swear. It's 527 left in the half. Every Burke foul leads to two clone shots now. Here's where the fouls get you. And that shot oh. is no good. Rebounded by Burke. Still a lead. Still a lead. And Burke it's out of bounds. To the corner, and it is out of bounds. That's how you play. This is our chance to take a decent lead here. Come on, guys. A decent lead being like seven points. <laughs> That's just decent. Yeah, just basketball shoot. is a game where the leads can change very quickly, and a five point lead doesn't amount to anything. Five oh, points! Oh, 22-19 and a shot coming in from Jack here. Come on, Jack, you can do this. Come on. And, and an inbound pass almost stolen by Joseph. Knocked it out of bounds. This reminds me of Monsters Inc. where that guy gets the monster gets the sock on his back. 23-19. Oh yeah. <laughs> Long pass by Burke to get it in bounds. Well yeah, they have to. They're they getting swarmed. Jo Joseph there. And a foul on Colom and Burke will inbound the ball here. Excellent game going on here between two really well-matched teams. Oh, yeah. And the inbound it's pass stolen. stolen by Joseph Lapras. Of course it's Joseph. Joseph is the, the little demon Three point here. shot by Seth. Misses. And rebounded by Burt. He breaks everyone's hopes and dreams, I swear. <laughs> He just seems to come out of nowhere and steal passes. Shot by Burke. He could is be in no Africa. Good. He and could be in Africa. Burke. And he would just <laughs> fly out it out here and steal that pass. Steal a pass from another hemisphere. Yep. Jack Anderson at the free throw line. 430 left in this quarter. Or left in the half, I guess. 23-19 lead for Cologne. I wish I could be like him. Shoot. Jesus. Come. Oh, yeah. Perfect shot by Jack. 24 19. Five point lead. We just keep growing on it. Yeah, Joseph just flies out of nowhere and takes that ball. Come on, Cowboys. Get Perfect. that. Woo! Perfect shot by Jack. 25 19 now. Let's Six just points. keep building on it. Let's keep building on it. This is just Cowboys put some heavy pressure on Burke. And it's and stolen! And a foul on Burke! Woo! 
And who's going to the line? Joseph. Joseph Lapreth. Exactly the guy you want shooting it. 25-19, 4-19 left in the half. Got my button ready. There you go. 26-19, Joseph. Sinks his first shot. Whew. Second shot is beautiful. 27-19. Oh, that just makes me ticklish. Eight-point lead for Cologne here. Oh, Joseph wanted that so bad. Yeah. <laughs> and reaching in, oh. foul on Joe Musser. And that is the fourth foul for Cologne here, and Burke will inbound the ball. Come on, guys, don't get too feisty. Gotta play a bit more conservatively now, and they throw the ball away. Why did Joseph he try to save went it? After it and tried to save it and stepped out of bounds. Why did he try to save it? It was off I Burke. Don't know. Burke will inbound the ball here. If they can. Which they do. Heavy pressure by Cologne again. They are good at this stuff. Time out called. Time out called. 26. They could not get it across the half court. So we will take a little break and we will see you then. On your team's new uniforms or your office wear, Apparel Works is also the place to pick up your promotional items such as koozies, pens, and magnets. Contact their knowledgeable and friendly staff today at 605-384-3553 or visit their website at apparelworkssd.com. Whether you're pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide... And here we are. We've got... Cowboys in the lead, 27-19. It is Burke Ball. Second quarter, 26 seconds on the shot clock. Took him quite a bit to get there. Yeah. And it's yeah, hit ball by, away by Jonah. A loose ball. Oh, Jonah got kicked in the head, it looked like. Oh it, ha my it happens. Going after the ball hard, these guys, all both teams. That's five fouls for each. Five fouls each team. First shot is no, no good. good for Bert. Jinx here on the cook. <laughs> I have about two seconds from starting tickling you, boy. <laughs> Number 22, the second shot. No good. Let it go, let it go, let it go. And Tyson lets it roll out of bounds. Woo! Like they listened to us from all the way up here. It was psychic powers there. Telekinetic Tyson, powers. leave it alone. Tyson, leave it alone. And he left it alone. What Tyson hears, you should probably get it, <laughs> but you don't need to. <laughs> Seth Heath brings the ball across for the Cowboys. This pass is knocked and stolen by the, by the Cougars. Oh, it's the pass tipped! Is tipped by Jack, or Joseph into Jonah's arms. Excellent defense by the Cowboys here. Joseph pulls up, passes to Tyson, and back to Joseph. Oh, oh. it doesn't go. And a jump ball jump called. Ball. That's Cologne, isn't it? It will be Burke Ball. Burke Ball. Three minutes, five seconds left in this quarter. I could use half. a Coke. I need it. And the inbound pass is thrown away. And it is look at that heavy defense there by Seth Heath. An inbound pass to Joseph. Brings it around. Shoots. Blocked pat or blocked shot. Foul? And they throw the ball away. Loose ball <laughs> by Jack Anderson. Come on, Seth. Pass in to Jonah Musser. Back out to Jack Anderson. J 
Jack charges the basket and shoots. 29-19, a 10-point lead for our Cowboys. Basket blocked by Tyson Wetzel. This crowd is crazy right now. I should just yell at Tyson right now while it's quiet. Yeah, Tyson. Do it. Burke inbounds the ball and throw it away! Hey, it is Cologne ball! That is what you want. And Seth Heath bringing the ball down for the Cowboys. Pass over to Jonah Musser, who charges, shoots, and it is wow. deflected. And Burke comes up with the ball. 2.17 left in the quarter. Don't give him an open shot. There's the three that misses and rebounded by Jonah Woo! Musser. That's what happens when you play this, you yep. know. Joseph with a layup oh. missed. And blue ball, Joseph went out of bounds with it. 155 left in the quarter. Oh, Joseph comes flying down, threatening to steal the ball. Joseph knocks it out. See, the thing is, if it you is can disrupt them ball. enough until they throw it away, then that's great. Burke to inbound again. You get 10 seconds to get across that line. Yep. Just keep them like that, guys. You're trying. And it's oh, it's oh. Oh, it deflected off of Seth and a foul by Tyson Wetzel. Yeah, give him the butt. What <laughs> did you say what I thought you said? Give him the butt. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's like Jonah's got some blood coming out of his lip there. Jordan, can you not play if you have any blood on you? Yeah, I don't think so. Well, too bad. Game. My hands were like this <laughs> all the game. And missed his first free throw. Woo! Well, you weren't dripping blood, though. You remember Bauer pitching in the World Series with the bloody finger? Yeah. The championship series, whatever it was. And he sinks the ball. It's a 29-20 game. 130 left in this uh, half here. Nine-point lead by the Cowboys. Pass to Joseph Lapras. Charges and shoots. No good. Recovered by Jack. Oh. And Burke collects the rebound this time. Come on, guys. Pressure. See what happens when they don't pressure? Yep. Well. And open three. No. Oh, it's good. 29-23. Come on, guys. Point lead for the Cowboys. Come on, Cowboys. Joseph Lapith bringing the ball down. Come on, Joseph. Three-point shot. Beautiful. Feel the burn of that thing. And an open three for Burke. Does no. not go. Rebounded by Burke. And another. Oh, he just about shot it. Another three. Come on, guys. Don't Rebound. give him open shots. And a two-point shot there by Burke. 32-25. Joseph coming down with 30 seconds left in the half. Pass to Seth Heath. Out to Tyson Wetzel here. Back Tyson, to just don't shoot it. Like. Pass into Jack Anderson, spins and shoots, and they oh. don't travel on him. I don't know about that, but okay. 17 seconds. Burt brings it across half court. 10 seconds left. Don't let him shoot an open shot, guys. Come on. No, it does not go. And, and we go into halftime. 
32-25 in favor of the Cowboys. And we will see you after the break. Services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. You've spent years dreaming up your business plan, saving every dollar, searching for the right location, and perfecting your product. Auto Owners ensures your small business, because it isn't small to you. Only 36 more to go. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller and Associates in Platte, South Dakota, if auto owners make sense for you. You've spent years... Winter Dental, located at 911 Golden Prairie Drive, is proud to provide Winter and the surrounding area with high-quality, high-tech, patient-centered dentistry. Dr. Brad and the entire staff including hygienists Michaela Smith and Sierra Hansen, are honored to have the opportunity to serve the good people of Winter and the surrounding area with gentle, compassionate, and high-quality dental services. For information on all the services they can provide you or to make an appointment, please call 605-842-1793 or go to winterdentalclinic.com. Lucky for us, life is full of choices, big and small. They define us, make us who we are. And when it comes time for you to choose a car, home, your next big adventure, or start a new business, Farmers Union Insurance has the variety of coverage options to protect each perfect moment. Farmers Union Insurance. Contact your local Farmers Union Insurance agent today. Lucky for us. Your grandmother's fine china, those trendy sneakers, your collection of hand-carved duck decoys. Auto Owners protects your home. Because, well, somebody should. That's simple human sense. Ask Miller and Associates in Platte, South Dakota, if auto owners make sense for you. Oh, now you do your job. Core Cares helps individuals stay at home by offering caregiving, nursing, and medical alert systems in over 55 communities in South Dakota. Specializing in tasks like bathing, meal prep, and medication setups, our well-trained staff delivers exceptional care. We invest in our team through customized training and comprehensive benefits. To learn more about job opportunities or services, visit our website at corecares.com. Core Cares, proudly serving our community. Core Cares helps. Schrader Electric and Control, located in Winter, is available for all your electrical service needs. With close to 40 years of experience, Brian and his crew can take care of all your electrical projects, residential or commercial. Schrader Electric works with new construction, remodels, and new additions. Call Brian at 605-840-8913 to get a quote or schedule your next electrical service. Schrader Electric and Control is a proud sponsor of the schools on the Live Ticket Network. Do you have a pest problem? Got bats, ants, termites? Family owned and operated, Olson's Pest Technicians have had over 50 years experience taking care of pest problems in places across South Dakota, Nebraska, and Iowa. Utilizing brilliant methods such as Centricon bait stations for termites and Vicane treatment for bed bugs, there's no pest too tough for Olson's Pest Technicians. If you have pest problems, call 800 Kill Bugs. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and fatherhood support. To learn more about Great Plains Healthy Start, visit greatplainstravelhealth.org or call one of our five service areas today. Brought to you by Great Plains Healthy Start, so that the people may live. 
Meyer Ag is your Bex Hybrids seed dealer located in Winters, South Dakota. Meyer Ag is a family-owned company specializing in seed consulting and zone-based variable rate that services South Central South Dakota. Contact Trace Meyer at 605-842-5458 to learn more about Bex Hybrids and see how Meyer Ag can make every acre count for you. Meyer Ag in Winters, South Dakota is a proud supporter of all youth athletics and activities. We connect people, have been for a hundred years or so. How we get that done? Well, that won't always be the same. But why we connect people? Not in a million years is that ever gonna change. We didn't build the communities that made South Dakota, no. We just brought them together. Being a part of a community means sharing the history and future of the people all around you. For 115 years, First Fidelity Bank has been doing just that, helping you get the most out of life by providing the services and tools you need, the conveniences and technology you want, and the friendly faces you expect. So you get everything you need right here in the place you call home. Now and for many years to come. First Fidelity Bank. Being a part of a community. We hope you are all enjoying the student productions of your school. Tonight's event and every event produced by your school during the school year are created, filmed, and produced by the students you love to follow and support. Become a booster of your school's live event coverage by becoming a sponsor. It's a great way to show your support of the athletes and students in your community. As a sponsor, you'll get great visibility for your business, organization, or family by supporting the live productions of your school. Wow, Bill, you're walking so much better. What did you do? Well, I got so tired of the pain and nearly fell. And one of my friends recommended physical therapy at Winter Physical Therapy. And you know what? My back also stopped hurting. Huh. So how did you get started? My doctor wrote me a referral, but that's not always needed. Turns out you always have a choice where you want to go. So why did you choose Winter Physical Therapy? I love to support our locally owned small businesses. And quite frankly, they give great personalized care. Winter Physical Therapy. Exceptional care. The right nutrition, animal health, and record management is key to having a profitable cattle program. That's why you want to work with the people at FarmCo, who will take the time to learn your operation and help you grow your business. We are your full-service agriculture provider of feed, seed, animal health, farm, and ranching equipment built on terrific service. Get to know FarmCo locally owned and serving you in Chamberlain, Platte, Winter, and east of Kimball at the Paragon. Visit us online at FarmCoSD.com. FarmCo, Farm feeding, feeding your, your future. future. Early seed season is here. Litaw Seed carries Hefty brand corn and beans for their genetics, technology, and treatments. Hefty's corn has been very drought tolerant and an excellent yielding. We also have Enlist and Extendiflex soybeans for your choice in herbicide. With Dynagro, we're at the top of the South Dakota field trials for their sunflowers and milo. And with Millbarn, we're the leader in grass, cover, crop, and forages. Call 605-840-4591 for Litaw Seed, your source for corn to cover crops, soybeans to sunflowers, and all forages. That's 605-840-4591. Early the innocence of youth. Is there anything any better? But soon they'll be in high school and facing all the same challenges you faced. How to make friends. How to fit in. How to be cool. We want our children to have everything they'll need to live fulfilling and productive lives. Make sure the kids in your family are among the more than 57,000 participants here in South Dakota who take part in high school sports or activities. No job is too big or small for the gang at h and Electric in winter. Whether it's a simple task around the house, remodel, new addition, or new construction, we provide residential, commercial, and industrial heating, cooling, or electrical work in winter and the surrounding area. We handle it all. Call 605-842-1117 for service or more information on your next project, big or small. h and Electric is your authorized dealer for train heating systems, too. Good luck in today's event. h and Electric is a proud supporter of all area student athletes and activities on live ticket TV. 
No job is too- If you have a Grossenberg custom calendar, now is the month you can have some fun and get a free can of John Deere glass cleaner. How is that, you may ask? Take the maze challenge on the February calendar, complete it from start to end, and bring it in to one of Grossenberg's nine locations, parts departments, and receive one free can of John Deere glass cleaner. Grossenberg Implement is your John Deere location for fun and savings. Offer only valid for one customer per month. Must present a copy or the actual completed maze to qualify. See parts staff for complete details. John Deere glass cleaner part number TY25 684. If you have a grosser. Just as you aim to reach new heights on the field or court, Elevate Agronomics is here to help you do the same on your farm. Putting together a solid plan for each customer is the goal at Elevate, so you can win all season long. With a full lineup. And here we are, it is a 32 to 25 lead for the Cowboys. Got their starting five out there. Cowboy ball. Cowboy ball to start off the third quarter here. And Burt player reaching over the line there to block the ball. The Cowboys will inbound again. And inbound pass to Jonah Musser. And back to Seth. Seth looking. Doing his thing. Come on, Passing boys. Keep it to the Jack, who shoots and misses and rebounded by Burke. Keep the momentum going, guys. Oh, Come by on. the way, they had no sprites. Oh. So. <laughs> and a shot by Burke is good. It's 32 27. Joseph Lapworth brings the ball down for us. Pass almost stolen by Burke. And it's good from Jordan, Jordan Musser. 34-27 now. Oh, almost an open three. Man, you can't leave those guys open. Come on. Rebounded by Jack Anderson. I found out former Cologne student and one of my students at USD, Nolan Welker, will be arguing in front of the Supreme Court shortly. Is that a good thing or a that bad thing? That is a phenomenally good thing, okay. yes. Oh, he's sure. arguing for the Supreme Court? No, 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 no. Oh, against he's it? He's a lawyer, and he's going to be bringing a case in the Supreme Court. Oh. It's the highest court in the U.S. It is very amazing. Former Cologne student. And a basket there by Burke, and I got to teach him at USD. I didn't know him. So he uh, went here? Yeah, he and his brother and his sister. I, when I first started here, his younger sister was in high school. Noah was an excellent kid, excellent student. Did you like him when you're Oh, you yeah, I like him? Nolan a lot, yep. Yeah. So, Nolan, if anybody who knows Nolan is listening, tell him I'm proud of him. And the basket by Burke, and it's a 34-31 game now. And a shot from the corner is no good, but a foul on the shot. Oh, no. And it will be Jordan Musser coming to the line. Hey, that's a good thing. So, you know, I, teaching at USD, I had a lot of kids from these little towns, and I always tried to tell them, like, look, it doesn't matter if you come from a tiny town. You can do something. Yeah. Oh, I thought that was good. Bounced off the back of the rim. Come on, Jordan. His second shot, perfect, 35-34, or 35-31. Four-point lead for Cologne, and Burke quickly brings the ball down. Three-point shot, no good, rebounded by Cologne. Jordan Musser with the rebound. Seth Heath brings the ball down for us. Almost called him Cash again. Shot by Joseph, no good, and rebounded by Cologne. The sadness in her voices. What's that? The sadness in her voices. I almost called him Cash again. Yeah. <laughs> Season ends just about the time I get all these guys sorted out. <laughs> See, I sorted them out a and long the time ball, ago. the ball is thrown away, and it will be Cologne ball. 
Yeah, it's just looking through the screen, you know. Yeah. It's tough to tell who's who all the time. Sooner or later, you'll get it. And I've learned their numbers. You have? Yep. I have. And shot from the corner is no good. And it goes out of bounds, and it is Burke Ball. And we got some fans blowing in here in the gym. It has been excessively warm in here tonight. Yeah. It's usually always a bit warm, but it's a bit too much tonight. Oh, almost stolen by Jordan Musser. And under the basket, shot by Burke is good. It's 35-33, and they are closing the gap here. No more closing. Come on, Seth. Just charge let it, us charge do it. that. Blocked shot from Jordan, or Jack, rather. And a foul, or no, timeout called, timeout called. It looks like it will be Burke Ball. So we will take a timeout as well. Seeds, including corn, soybeans, alfalfa, sorghum, forage, cover crops, wildlife habitat, and more, along with a full line of chemicals and plant health products, Elevate is ready to put your plans into action. Check us out at elevateagronomics.com or stop by the office in winter today. Elevate Agronomics, reach new heights. Your local cooperative has a new name. CHS Northern Plains and CHS Midwest Cooperative have joined together to better serve you under the new name CHS River Plains. You gain more options. And we are back with I, some more Cologne stuff. I was wrong. It is Cologne Ball. thought it was going to be Burke Ball. Shot by Joseph. And he made it's it! Good and he <laughs> point shot and drew the foul. We have a Burke player on the floor. He's watching oh, it, what he caused. Yeah, he got busted on the head, it looks like. Oh, it might be an eye. Looks like it says eye. He's looking at what he caused. No. No. Just a bit of a collision. Yeah. Joseph with a shot here. I think it was honestly the Burke guy that bumped into him. Well, yeah, that's why there's a foul. Yeah. One shot for Joseph here. So, Bear, you were asking earlier. Four points for Cologne. 39-33. Of course he does it. Of course. Of course he does it. Don't leave these guys open. Come on. Three-point shot. It is good. It's 39-36. Cash bringing the ball down. Come on, guys, don't blow the lead. And a three-pointer by oh. Joseph, no good. Rebounded by jo Jonah, and his shot was no good. The J-Names just get us. Yeah. Rebounded by Burke, and they shoot a three. No good. Rebounded by Cash Hemming. Come on, Cash. And stolen by Burke. Man, that's tough. A foul on Jonah Muster there. He always admits it. Yep, he always admits it. <laughs> Guys, I did it. Both teams with two fouls. 4-10 left in this quarter. And a three-point clone lead. And Span, I thought he was going to shoot open. Three, nope. And a foul committed by Burke. Not sure what it was. People are clapping, so I clap. <laughs> he ends up with Cologne Ball. He completely faked and that guy And the ball out. stolen by Burke and stolen right back by Cologne. That happens actually more Seth than you would think. Seth with a beautiful shot that just doesn't go. How did that not fall? It's called being a cowboy. Yep, and a layup by Burke, and it's a one-point game with three and a half minutes left. Come on, 39-38. You can't let this stuff fly by because you were doing it too. <laughs> Pass under the basket to Jack Anderson out to Joseph Lapper, then a three that doesn't oh. go. And it's rebounded by Burke, and they are running down the court. How does it not fall? It just does not fall. I thought he was going to go for a That's layup a there. A nincompoop. Almost threw the ball away. And the basket is oh, by Joseph! 
and the lead. Good. 41-38. What a player Joseph Lapreth has been for Cologne. What a player. And the ball is thrown away by Burt. Woo! I just keep talking about Joseph. Maybe that'll work. Yeah, what a player. I think you'll get accepted for college at a university. I have no idea, bud. He could be accepted if he applies. Whether you get a scholarship or not, I have no idea what basketball scouts look for. Athleticism, Fast break probably. by the Burt. Cougars, and they get the points. It's a 41-40 game. And Joseph charges back down. Pass no. to Jonah, and he loses the pass. Burke passes down, layup, and they take the lead, 42-41. Two to minutes, 41. 15 left in the quarter. Timeout by Colomb. And we will take a timeout, too. More value, access to global markets in a powerful supply chain. And you can do more every day using inputs delivered by a team who knows what you need, when you need it. Visit us online at chsriverplains.com or stop in today and let us help you own every day. Your first car. It might not have been perfect, but that didn't matter. You loved it because you worked hard for it. You took care of it and it took care of you, your friends, and maybe that someone special. And through it all, we were there working with you, for you, to make sure it was a smooth ride. Farmers Union Insurance. More choices, great rates, local agents. Contact your local Farmers Union Insurance agent today. Shop local with Burke and Gregory Building Centers, your hometown hardware stores, specializing in everything from finding the right drill bit to building your dream home. Announcers. And here we are. Joseph had to tie his shoes. Cologne will inbound the ball here. 2 11 left in this quarter. He's got the shoe relaces. Pass to Jonah who shoots and misses and rebounded by Burke. Got to get those rebounds, guys. Burke charging and the shot is Miss. no good. Rebounded Miss. by Cologne. Pass to Joseph. Layup is no good. Rebounded by nobody. Cologne. <laughs> shot goes in. I said rebounded by and I looked. It was a loose ball. <laughs> that happened. Rebounded happens. by the floor. And Burke quickly takes the lead back. It's 44-43 with one and a half minutes left. And Cologne slows the game down a bit. Please Cash Hamming brings the ball across court. Passes to Joseph and he shoots. No good. Oh. And the ball went out of bounds. And Did it is not. Burke's ball. 44-43 Burke lead. And they come down with 1.15 left in the quarter. Pass out to number 10. And 20. Joseph going after the passes. Missed shot. Rebounded, rebounded by Clove. Jonah Musser with the rebound. And Cash Hemming bringing it down. We are under a minute. Come on, Cash. Pass to Seth Heath. Over to Jack Anderson. And a travel. And a travel called. One hop too many, Jack. One hop too many. 44, 43, 47 seconds left. <sighs> Big yawns for little baby. Little bear. And a three point shot is no good. And. It is Cologne ball. Jack Anderson sliding on the floor after that ball. 30 seconds. I wouldn't do that because I've got burned by that. Yeah. 30 seconds left. Cologne ball. You know why you get burned by that? It's called science. <laughs> it's a little thing called friction. Yep. And an open three by Joseph oh, does not go. That's not Rebounded Joseph. That's Cash. Oh, sorry. Cash. Rebounded by Burke. Shot does not go, does not go, and rebounded by nobody. This ball. Dive for the ball. Timeout by Burke. 
Seven seconds left, 44-43. We will take a short time out. Burke and Gregory Building Centers take pride in customer service and are always available to help with any project, big or small. They offer top-of-the-line flooring and cabinetry, a large inventory of rental items, quality Pittsburgh paint, and so much more. Follow them on Facebook and shop online anytime at bgbuildingcenter.com. At American Family Insurance, we help protect what you've achieved so you can fearlessly go after your dreams. For auto, home, business, and life, contact us today. American Family Insurance. Insure carefully. And here we are. We're back. It is 44-43 in favor of Burke. Which, yes, it's one point. That's a good, good, everybody's in a good position here. So if you don't want those open threes, two-point shot, no good. And that is the end of the third quarter. We go into the final quarter, separated by one point. 44-43 Burke lead, and we will be back in just a second. Fearlessly. American Family Insurance, Life Mutual, Standard of Ohio, and Wisconsin Company, 6000 American Parkway, Madison, Wisconsin, 53783. Agrimax and West River Ag have been in the winter area for a combined total of nine years. We offer top-of-the-line services and inputs such as chemical, seed, fertilizer application, spraying, and agronomy services with a certified crop advisor on staff. We are a full-service business that is locally owned and operated. We look forward to continuing service to the ag community and cannot wait to help you with all your agricultural needs. Agrimax, shaping the future. And here we are. Burke is out, and the Cowboys now break. <laughs> Joseph to inbound the ball. Passes it to Jonah. Oh, he throws the ball away. Saved by Cash Hemming. Pass to Jack Anderson. Back to Joseph. Foul! Oh. Two shots! Get us back on the board, guys. We were never on the board. <laughs> Come on, Joseph. Just kidding. We were on the board first. Perfect shot. We have a tied game. He Come can on, almost, Joseph. almost... Almost always make those. Yeah, he's not the guy you want to be fouling. No. But here's the thing. You have Does to just go. to get him not to shoot. Yeah. Because anyways, he's going to get points. Tied game here in Cologne. And, and Burke throws away. the ball away. Woo! And there in the corner. You see Cologne's junior high coach, Brett Heath, watching the game. Almost Woo! away. Shot does not go. Rebounded by Clome. Oh, no good either. And Burke rebounds. How does it not get in? I don't know. It just doesn't go. The curse of And God. that shot is good. It's 46 44. Burke with the lead. Seven minutes left. Pass to Jack Anderson, and the ball is almost stolen by Burke. Three-point shot, no good. And Burke comes out with the rebound. Don't let him start pulling away here, guys. Come on. 48 to 44. Come on, guys. I'm Jack Anderson keys. bringing the ball down and throws the ball away. Oh. This is what happens. And Burke coming down the court with the ball now. Pass under the basket. Foul uh, on the shot. No. 48-44, and we have got two shots for number 44. Six and a half minutes left in this game. Who's tickling who down there? <laughs> and the first shot is off the rim. 
No good. It's still 48-44. Number 44 with his second shot here. Come on, guys. You have to get a rebound. Did he make that? Nope. And he made that one. 49-44, a five-point Burt Glead. And Clome almost throws the ball away again. Burke knocks the ball out of bounds here. And Sam or uh, Seth rather will inbound the ball for us. Pass to Jonah Musser. Not to Seth Heath. Uh, I'm quiet because I'm tired. <laughs> Shot does not go and it's rebounded by Burke. I'm not running my big mouth. That's all right. I'm running mine, so. And a jump ball. Ah! And it remains Burke ball here. What? No. It's been Burke ball and jump balls for three times. <laughs> I know. And a pass into the lane. Outside, three-pointer, no good. And jump ball again, and it goes to Cologne. Ha ha, suckers. This time, six minutes left in the game. How you like the feel of that? Five minute, or a five, five, five minute, minute quarter. Five point game here. Oh, and Joseph throws the ball away to Burke. And a layup goes in, and it is 51-44 in favor of the uh, Cougars. Oh, this is where they pull away. And the pass goes out of bounds. The Cowboys will inbound the ball again. Joseph with a shot. It is perfect. It's a 51-46 game. Five points separate these teams. It is anybody's game. Pass almost stolen. Foul on Cologne there. And Burke will inbound the ball. Outside the three-point line, and the shot is good. 54-46, an eight-point lead for, for uh, the Cougars. But hey, they came back from 10 points. Yep. And the ball almost stolen by the by Burke. Knock it out of bounds. It is Cologne ball. What would happen if someone just randomly punched someone? That would be a big foul. But <laughs> Aww. My disappointment. And a foul on the uh, by the Cougars, and Joseph Lapith goes to the line again. Come on, Joseph. Perfect shot, 54-47. Come on, Joseph, just sink Second it. Second shot coming. Good. And it's 54-48, a six-point game. Cougars in the lead. And an open three. Does Missed. not go and yes. is rebounded by Seth Heath. Come on, guys. Seth brings the ball down for the clone. And he charges and shoots and misses and rebounded by Burke. And pass is stolen by Joseph. Pass to Seth. And the shot is no good and rebounded by Burke again. Come on. Who's the travel? No, he ran across about 10 feet there. 56 to there's 48. There's no way there's not a travel for that. Three-point shot is beautiful. 56-51, and we are back to five points here. And the Cougars throw the ball away. And knocks a big bag of popcorn down onto the floor. Oh! I'll take the rest of it. Yes, thank you. <laughs> I was going to ask for some. 
They're handing it out. Don't worry about the popcorn, son. I'll eat it right off the floor. <laughs> <laughs> right off. Jack tries to set an open shot for cash, but he doesn't take it. Pass to Jack Anderson. And a foul called on Burke. And the Cowboys will inbound the ball here with four minutes left in this game. Five points separating these teams. Come on, Cowboys. Inbound pass to Cash Hemming. It was uh, tipped, was it? Yep, it was. Shot by Cash, no good. And he is out of bounds. And it is Burke ball. 3.49 left in the game here. And a Burke player tying his shoe. And they get the inbound successfully in. Nobody ever gives us popcorn because we're not in the crowd. We're not down there. No. And a shot by Burke is good, and it's a seven-point game. And a foul called on the Cougars. Joseph draws another foul. Woo! Joseph brings the ball down, pass to Jack Anderson, and fouled on the shot. Not Jack. Oh, sorry, Jonah, Jonah Musser. At times I have to tell you. I know. How many times I have to tell you. Jonah with his first shot. We are us. No good. 58-51, 3.36 left. This is where they pull away. And come on, Jonah. Come on. I'm going to go get my hoodie on. Ah, be careful setting that down, bud. The second shot, no good. Rebounded by Burke. And they slow up really quickly. And the pass is stolen by Joseph, who puts a layup in. And it's 58-53. Good defense by Joseph Lapreth. Burke brings the ball back down. And a long three-point shot is good. And it's 61-53. And a three-pointer. No good. Rebounded by Cologne. The shot is good. It's 61-55. Er, Six-point Burke lead, 250 left in the game. I'm back. Nice and warm now. Got a little cold Got all chilly, of a sudden. huh? It has been hot all night. Three-point shot again, missed and rebounded by Cash Hemming. I still am mad about that missed travel. Yeah. Three-pointer by Joseph does not go and rebounded by Burke. And they pass all the way down the court with a layup, 63-55, 2.20 left. Still anyone's game. Still can come back from this. Travel called on Jack Anderson, and Burke will inbound the ball. Yeah, forget it. Um, That's a rough call. Hey, you call traveling on him moving three inches, and you don't call a guy moving ten feet. I know. And Burke inbounds. Biased. Now, now, Bear. No. Now I'm going to start that. 210 on the clock. And Burke will inbound underneath us here. Hey, they cleaned up the popcorn at least. Yeah, they did. There's still a little bit, but. Burke gets it in successfully and pass under the basket. And a jump ball called, and it is. It should be Burke Ball here. Yeah. They will inbound the ball. Open shot. Does not go. Rebounded by Jonah Musser. Seth Heath quickly bring the ball down for Cologne. Charges and shoots and no basket. And a jump ball called and it is Cologne Ball.
Cash aiming to inbound. Pass to Seth Heath. Does oh. not get the basket to go, but Cash rebounds. Shoot. Pass to Joseph and a three-pointer misses. Shot, rebounded by Jonah Musser. Pass back to Cash to Seth Heath. Yeah. And Seth is stuffed and fouled. Seth is fouled. I didn't see the foul, but two shots for Seth. One and a half minutes left. Eight-point game. Come on, Seth. Perfect shot. 63-56. Come on, Seth. Second shot. Beautiful. 63-58. And a timeout called, and we will take a timeout, too. This is what matters. This is beyond X's and O's. This is the difference mutual respect makes. This is what character looks like. This is what defines us in South Dakota. This is sportsmanship. School sports, it's not the outcome that matters most, but the way the games are played. This message presented by the South Dakota High School Activities Association and the South Dakota Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association. And here we are back it's still a 63 57 lead wait it's 57 yeah oh, i had it down to 58 but okay burke successfully inbounds across the half court line oh i thought that was stolen for a second passing around a bit Burning some time off the clock. Shot is missed. Rebounded by Colom. Joseph Lapworth runs it down. And his shot is no good. Rebound. Wow, and the basket by Jack Anderson. But he could still come back. 63-50. Absolutely. Er, yeah, 63-59. Absolutely, bud. Four points. 107 on the clock, and Jack has a shot here. We're going to start pressuring hard. Oh, yeah. One shot for Jack. Go on, Jack, make it three points. No good on the shot. Almost out of the shot. Rebound and pass to Seth, and he missed the layup. Pass all the way down the court to Burke, and it is a layup, and that makes it a six point game with less than a minute to go. Come on, Cash, pass to Seth Heath, and the shot. <laughs> Three-point game with 47 seconds left. Come on, guys. Press as hard as you can. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on, guys. 65, 62, 30 seconds left. They're burning as much time off as they possibly can. The pass under the basket. Shot is no good. Yes! Rebounded by Colon. got it. And it is Burke Ball. Out of bounds on Cologne. Come on, guys. Get this. You got this. You guys deserve this. Come on, man. Time out. You got to be kidding. And so we will take a time out, too. Is your team or organization looking to improve their look? Are you looking for quality custom apparel with fast, friendly service from people you can trust? Then contact Apparel Works in Wagner, South Dakota. They can provide you with all kinds of options of screen printing or embroidery on your team's new uniforms or your office wear. Apparel Works is also the place to pick up your promotional items such as koozies, pens, and magnets. Contact their knowledgeable and friendly staff today at 605-384-3553 or visit their website at apparelworkssd.com. Whether you are pregnant or planning ahead, you and your baby deserve a healthy start. We offer a wide range of services such as advocacy, health screenings and education, care coordination and car seat safety, participant empowerment, referral services and father. And here we are. It is the fourth quarter with 22 seconds left. It is a 65-62 game. 
and Burke has the ball. Burke will inbound here. Just, I just want us to win. We deserve this. And foul. No. Yeah, that's what you do to try to get them shooting. So you, so they don't just hold the ball. Oh, okay. 18 seconds left. They inbound the ball again. And just go to shoot and a foul. And the shot is good. And that pretty much seals the deal. That pretty much seals it right there. 67-62. No, what if we shoot a three-pointer? Make it. Yeah. Then like, we steal it and shoot it. Yeah, it could happen. And 68-62 with 16 seconds left. Jack Anderson bringing the ball down. Shits up for a three. <laughs> three points separate him. Eight seconds. He's fouled by Cash Hemming. That was a push. Yep, on purpose. And he will get his shots. It's a three-point game with six seconds left. On purpose, yeah. Why? Why did you do that? To get him shooting so oh. the Cowboys have a chance to get the rebound or they get the possession again. And it's a 69-65 game. Yeah, it's done. No, wait, we could th shoot a three-pointer and, three and get fouled. Yep. But we'd have to make that and it'd have to be Joseph. And that shot is good. It's a 70-65 game. Jo Joseph Lapworth with a shot is no oh. good. And that is the game. What a game. What a game by both teams. Congratulations to the Burt Krugers with their 70-65 win. What a game played by the Cowboys. <clears throat> that was a tough loss. Yeah. That is a tough loss. And this is our final live stream of the year for the varsity basketball. We will have tomorrow a junior, no, Thursday. Thursday, a junior high boys game. I will be playing. So. What time is the game, bud? I think it's four. Four o'clock, all right. No, five. It starts at five. Starts at five. All right, yeah. well, what we will do, I will live stream that just so uh, I can get Abraham on the screen here playing, playing basketball. It's been a really good time doing this. I never imagined doing something like live streaming sports in a high school. But it has been a really good time. I hope you all have enjoyed listening to us. We've got, uh, like I said, or like Abraham said, the junior high game here on Thursday. And then we're done. And then we are finished until the fall. Anything final you'd like to say, Bear? Go Cowboys. Go Cowboys. All right, well, thank you all for listening. Thank you to the, the Burke fans for coming out tonight and for listening to us. And we will see you hopefully Thursday to watch some junior high basketball. Yep.